Alex, 48 games into this season, where would you rate your team right now? I know there's been some good moments, there's been some bad. It seems fans think you guys are going to win the World Series when you win four in a row, and then these same fans think that you guys are toast when you lose four or five in a row. And it's part of the game. It happens all the years I've been in the organization. I know it's going to happen over six months. Uh, streaks, hot and cold, things like that. So I think you try to stay even keel. Uh, you're going to have a stretch when, like you said, you win a lot, a lot of games and you lose a lot of games. Uh, but overall, you know, obviously this past trip, uh, we had some rough starts and that set us behind. But you look at what the starters have done year in and year out. You know, really for the first two months of the year, uh, other than this last trip, they've been outstanding. So they've earned the right uh, to have some bumps in, in the road along the way. And it's not fair to expect them to be unbelievable like they have been for six months straight. I know when you signed Vladimir Guerrero, it was one of those situations where you have nothing to lose. Have you been pleasantly surprised with how he has progressed? He seems to be running better than I remember him running last year in Baltimore, and I think the hitting is something that seems to come natural to him. No, he's he's played well. I mean, he's playing right now in high A ball in the Florida State League, so the competition is not bad, but it's certainly not what it would be up here. And right now everything's moving in the right direction, so probably spend the next week there and probably get him to either New Hampshire or Las Vegas after that, and we'll really get a better sense of how he does swing the bat for us. Alex, i got to ask you, over the last couple of weeks, we saw the incident with Brett Laurie uh, here and on the road where, you know, he just asked an umpire what happened, and he gets told, you know, don't argue with me. We saw Henderson Alvarez get thrown out for reasons I still can't figure out. Is there anything you can do as a GM to talk to the umpires, smooth things over, or just find out where things are at right now? Because, you know, there are human emotions involved in this. It has to be. No doubt. I think both the incidents happen in a short period of time. I don't think that they're related at all. Um, Henderson gave up three home runs in a row. He's a strike thrower. Again, his ball moves a lot. So I don't, and he does, he has to throw inside and he hit him. So I've seen that happen. Guys give up a few home runs. The next guy gets hit. A guy gets tossed. It's not, the, it's not anything we haven't seen before. Obviously, with Brett, you know, he had the the incident. It's fresh. I understand that. I mean, we've been through. Uh, you know, I think Brett will be fine. I think it's past. Um, I think there's just been an unfortunate chain of events. Henderson gives up two home runs. We don't have that, that problem instead of three. So uh, we'll get through it. And I think when we look back over the course of the next three or four months, we're not even going to have to talk about it.